Here's problem 34. I've zoomed in on the picture. It says the floor plan for a modern home is modeled by the composite of a regular nonagon. So this is regular, meaning all sides are the same length and all angles are exactly the same and it has nine sides. That's what it means by nonagon. And then there's a triangle right here. Okay. Now it says it says that every one of these sides is the exact same length. Well, if all of them are the same, it's an equilateral, meaning each one of these angles is 60 degrees. It says, what is the measure? It wants us to find J to K to L. It wants us to find this outside angle right here. How big of an opening is that? Now, I know all the way around is 360. I've already got 60 here. So if I can find this angle right here, this J, K down to here, if I can find that, I can simply add those together and then subtract from 360 and it'll tell me how long that is. Now I know it looks almost you know, if it comes straight, it would have been 180, so it's a little less than 180, but it's pretty close to that. So, how are we going to figure this out? Well, there's a couple ways. Let's just go with the basic way in this picture that might make the most sense to us. We have this formula that it gives us on the sheet um, that tells us what the sum of all these angles inside this nonagon happen to be. If we do the formula n minus 2 times 180, that'll tell us the sum of all the angles in here. Well, if I do that, there's nine sides, nine minus two, seven. Seven times 180, I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you that's 1,260. So every one of these angles inside this big shape adds up to 1,260. Now, if each angle's the same though, how can we figure out what each angle is? Well, if there's nine angles and they all have to be the same, and they all add up to 1260, let's just divide by nine. When you divide 1260 by nine, you get a perfect, beautiful 140 degrees for each one of these angles. Well, down in here, if this is 140 and this is 60, that's gonna add up to 200. Well, if you have 200 here, how much is left to complete and make 360? That's gonna be 160 degrees on the outside which in this case, if you look at the problem online, it is answer B that says 160 degrees. That's how you do problem number 34.